Hi everyone! Welcome back to my channel. So for today's video, I'll be showing you the newest trend in Mary Kay Makeup Collection. This is the limited, ed limited edition palette. Ayan, nakikita niyo naman. And sa loob niya to, ta-da! Ayan, andyan na yung highlighting and contouring. Actually, ang tawag sa kanya, illuminating bronzers. So we have the copper glow and also the gilded glow. So for today's video, I'll be showing you three different ways on how you can use it. Number one, of course, is highlighter. Number two, as contour powder. And number three, you can use this as your eyeshadow too. So let's get started. So we're back. Ngayon, sisimulan na po natin ang paggamit ng illuminating bronzers as your contour powder and also as your highlighting powder. So, dalawa to, pakita ko muna yung pagsuswatch natin. You have the copper glow. This one is actually the darker shade. Yan, pagka nilagay siya actually, sobrang dark din niya when you apply it. So, pwede natin i-check sa jawline. Ayan, yan yung copper glow. And yung isa naman, it's actually the Gilded Glow, the lighter one. Ito yun. So, kita nyo yung difference. So, ito talaga perfect for contouring. And ito naman, pwedeng konting highlighting. Okay? So, start na po tayo. Okay, blend ko lang siya. So, punta mo na tayo sa contouring. Ang isa kong trick din, you can use this. Alam nyo, very affordable lang to. You can ask your beauty consultants on how you can avail this one as your contour powder brush. Okay? So, gagamitin muna natin yung copper glow. So, when you do your contouring, always make like a number 3 on your face. Ganyan. Okay? So, kailangan ito. Yan, malagyan ng contour powder also dito. Sa hairline mo, tapos sa jawline mo. Yan, tsaka dito. Gusto-gusto natin lumiit. Okay? So, start muna tayo with, it, with regards to your copper glow. Apply lang tayo. Always remember, sobrang yung pigmented. So, hindi kailangan sobrang dami. Konti lang. Makikita mo na siya. Ayan, oh. Kita niyo. Ayan. See? Sa kabila. We'll also apply. And same here. Yan. Actually, depende talaga yun sa face shape. But for now, yung basic lang muna ituturo ko para alam nyo paano gamitin. And of course, blend it properly. Ayan. Blend, blend, blend. Blend lang natin. And of course, sa hair, hairline area. As I've said, sobrang pigmented na to. Kaya kailangan... Konti lang, okay na siya. Yan. So, nakikita nyo, nagkaroon na tayo ng sculpted part. Okay. Blend, blend lang. Yan, nakikita nyo na, diba? One of the techniques as well, you can use your sponge. This is actually cosmetic sponge from Mary Kay. So, kung gusto mo siyang dagdagan pa ng konti, pwede naman. Okay. Kasi gusto natin mas lumiit <laughs> ang ating yan dito cheek area. Lalo ka medyo chubby cheeks tayo. And of course, blend mo lang din sa hairline. And so, basic contouring lang tinuturo po natin para alam mo lang siya gamitin. Next, actually, you can use this yan, as your how about the highlighter. So, punta na tayo sa Gilded Glow. Ito yun, the lighter one. I'll be using the Mary Kate brush din to. So, saan ba tayo dapat nag-highlighter? Under the eyes. Pwede din siya. Okay. Where else? You can actually put here. Sa inyong forehead area. Dito pa sa may chin. Actually, yung mga areas talaga na dapat light yan. Forehead. Tapos, of course, under the eye. Dito lang banda. Ano pa? Dito, bro bone. Okay. Ito din sa my cupid area ng lips. Tapos, you can actually add sa my inner corner ng eyes mo. Okay? And of course, favorite, yan, konti lang amount, not too much. Because you don't want naman talaga sobra siyang mahalata. 
Ang maganda lang ding technique, talaga favorite ko po ito, when it comes to highlighting, you can add the Mercury Glaze Powder. Tapos yung isa din, Cinnabar to, all in one, pwede mo gamitin as eyeshadow and also contour powder. Yan. So, eto, dagdagan mo lang din ng glaze because glaze highlighter is really recommended, especially if you want to achieve this yan, luminous skin. Sabi nga, kumikilang-kilang. Ayan. Hinalo ko lang talaga siya with the Gilded Glow. Okay? So, that's the second tip. You can actually use it as your highlighting powder. So, ginamit ko, diba, the Gilded Glow. Lalo na kung gusto mong ma-achieve yung sun-kissed look lang. Okay? So, next na na tayo. Next step, that will be the eyeshadow. Hi! So, for now, we're gonna apply the eyeshadow. So, as you can see, I'm holding two brush. Isang flat brush, medicaid din yan, at isang crease brush. For the flat brush, I'll be using the Gilded Glow. Ito po yun. For the whole eye area. So, that will be used as your base. Sobrang pigmented. So, a little amount can go a long way. Konti-konti lang. Ayan. And next would be, eto na. The copper glue. So, as crease brush, sa dulo lang. Mag-V ka lang dyan, tapos accent mo lang siya. Same thing sa kabila. Ganun lang din po. Ang isa ko din technique, you can actually use the eye smudger brush. Because for the eye smudger brush, nakaka-help din to para mas maganda yung effect sa eye area. So, parang tatlo siya, diba, na shade. Pero, ginawa mo lang, blinend mo lang lahat. Yan. So, for the eye smudger brush, eto yon, medyo mas maliit siya. Gagamitin ko pa rin yung copper glow. Ang maganda lang kasi for the eye smudger brush, you can use this para din sa ilalim ng eye area. Here. So, ginamit ko copper glow sa ilalim. Half of it lang. And sa kabila din. Okay? Para lang may accent tayo. See? Nakita niyo yung difference. So, kahit pa paano nagkaroon siya ng blending, 101, di ba? And you can add a little amount of the Gilded Glow as well. Yan, gamitin mo lang yung ginamit mong flat brush kanina. Because eyeshadow is all about blending and you want light to dark effect. And yun nga, lagi ko talagang favorite po i-add tong glaze. Sabi ko, it's really a must-have. Kasi nakakadagdaganda talaga siya ng eyeshadow. So, dinalagay ko rin siya dito. Ayan na, see? Naka-pop lalo yung mata natin. Ayan. And here as well. Sa brow bone area nyo. Okay? Ayan. So, let's go for the finishing touches ng ating look for today. So, let's proceed with the liquid eyeliner. Ito yung waterproof eyeliner ni Mary Kay. Para mas maganda yung effect sa eyes. Ang maganda dito kahit mabasa, hindi talaga siya mag huhulas. Or, in English, diba? It's really waterproof, water resistant. Ang dali pa nang i-apply. At ang bilis matayo. Okay, sa kabila din. Kung beginner ka, I really suggest you could create dash line first. And then, pagdugtungin mo lang. But the key here, dahan-dahan ninyo po. Yan. Favorite ko to kasi, compared to the other, I, what do you call this? Eyeliner. Itong daling gamitin. Tsaka sobrang ganda na kasi waterproof na. And technique lang yung sinasabi to, when you store this pa ganito ha, hindi pa ganyan. Yung takip nasa baba dapat. Okay, see? How the eyeliner can really pop your eyes. And of course, I'll be using the Mary Kay Waterproof Mascara. Favorite ko din to. Because long wearing, kahit bigla ka maiyak, materialize, or pagpawisin ka, di ba yung iba, pawisin yung mata nila. This one is really recommended. So, how do you use it? Root to tip, wiggle lang. 
Galing na itong maka-lengthen and also volumize. The good thing about this product as well, even for us, lalo na ako, I'm a contact lens wearer, so hindi siya irritating sa eyes ko. Okay? Tsaka as you can see, kahit hindi na ako mag-eyelash curler, ang ganda na nagiging effect. Yan. So, Let's go with the finishing touches. So, what I did for today, ang emphasize ko lang talaga is how you can use this newest product as your contour powder. Hindi ko lang masyado initiman because an everyday look lang gusto ko mangyari. But as you can see, mas lumiit yung face natin with that illusion. And of course, I use the highlighter, ito, Gilded Glow, as my and eyeshadow as well and highlighting powder. So, kita nyo, two colors yan. So, it is a combination ng Gilded Glow and Copper Glow. Technique lang po palagi, the lighter one should be sa loob and as your base, and the darkest shade should be your accent. Okay? Yan. So, here's the finishing touches. Ganda ng effect, di ba? Simple way of having your contour and highlighting powder. Yan, ilagay lang natin siya sa ating jawline. Also, the areas na you want na mag-slim, like your cheek area. And of course, the highlighting powder saan natin nilagay? Under your eyes, for your nose line as well, and sa eye area natin. So, three ways again to use this product as your contour powder, highlighting powder, and as your eye shadow. So, this is a limited edition product here in the Philippines. So, if you have your beauty consultant, ask him or her on how can you avail this one, especially this palette as well. Ganda ng palette, limited edition din. But if you don't have one, you can, you can directly contact me. Check in the description box on how you can contact me through email and also in my other social media accounts. So, this is just also a reminder for this July. Few days to go, I'll be having my giveaway 2020 promo. If you haven't subscribed yet, please subscribe to this YouTube channel. You might win the worth almost 20, actually 10,000 of Mary Kay products. And hopefully, you're gonna be one of the lucky winners for the Mary Kay Skin Vigorate Sonic Brush. So join ka na, madali lang. I have my full mechanics in one of my vlogs here. You can check also in the description box. And if you have friends with you that you could share this video as well, kaya baka gusto din nilang maka-join sa giveaway promo natin. So, thank you for watching, ladies! Yan, sana po magkaroon din kayo ng limited edition na Copper Glow, Gilded Glow, and also this limited edition palette. Yan! So, always remember po, stay safe, stay beautiful, stay positive, and of course, stay healthy always. Bye!